and gentlemen, this is a story that caught my eye today. According to a new study, the United States is falling short when it comes to height. American men and women used to be the tallest people in the world. Now we rank 37th and 42nd. The tallest men and the women now are, uh, men and women are from the Netherlands and Latvia. Which, you know, it's like my mother always said, if you need to get something down from a high shelf, call a Latvian. But <laughs> this is disturbing. In fact, bring me my podium here, if you don't mind. Thank you very much. We need to get this country back on top, literally. America was founded by tall people. Abraham Lincoln was, you can't tell the dollar bill, George Washington was more than eight feet tall. <laughs> Are we going to let the Netherlands tower over us? I don't know about you, but I'm not. Are you Guillermo? No way. No, you, you actually are going to let the yeah. Netherlands tower over you, but I don't even believe the Dutch are the tallest people. I think they're adding two or three inches with those wooden shoes. And Latvia? Is Latvia even a real country? That's not a rhetorical question. I actually don't know. Is, do we have any Latvia? No. Anyway, when I am vice president, I will solve this in my first 100 days. And this is how I'll do it. If you are over five foot ten, you can stay. You can remain here and make babies long babies with other tall people, but if you're shorter than that, you may be relocated to Mexico and Canada. And I will build a wall to keep all the short people from sneaking back in. That's what we're gonna have to do. And it won't be that ex it won't be as expensive as Donald Trump's wall because it won't need to be that high, really. <laughs> In my America, you must be this tall to ride. So join me, full-sized people. Let's make America tall again. And most importantly, let's bond together to teach these Latvians a lesson they'll never forget.